Real shooting here, and in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a challenge video. Finally, another one. I'm gonna be doing the drop shot only challenge. I picked out a couple of my favorite lures and some new ones to try. So let's see, this is a new one. The Missile Baits Watermelon Red Bomb Shot. Has a lot of good reviews. They talk about it on Tactical Bass, and so it must be good. Here's another one they talk about. The Robo Worm. America's number one finesse worm. I got Aaron's Magic. The reason I got this one is because I have fished a similar color from KVD. Their KVD Dream Shot Lure. And this is a four and a half inch worm. I know that's going to catch fish for sure. I hope all these do. Here's a new one. I actually got this at the Bassmasters Classic for free. Pro Design Skeet Reef Straight Monkey. Skeet's Green Monkey. How to use, or I mean hook to use, drop shot. And I know these are going to have a lot of scent. So when the bite gets tough, I'm really going to pull those out. Because there's a lot of little bass in here, I brought out the Tiny Fluke. I brought out Smoke and Shad. I think this will get destroyed. And so will this, the Shimmer Shad in 4 inch, one of my favorite drop shot lures. It's actually one of the first lures I used when I started fishing the drop shot. I think I'm going to put this on first just because I have that much confidence in it. We're going to work our way up. I'll probably go to this next and then some of the other ones that I haven't caught fish on yet. I have caught them on these two, but not the other three. You guys stay tuned. bass we're gonna get a bite another thing too is fishing with that smaller pound line you get more bites too oh was that a little bite come on bass come back for it could be that or the weight is dragging on something there yeah, i think that was the weight Come on, bass. There we go, we got something. We got something, yes. Yes, come on bass. Yep, bass number one. Wow, why is he orange? He's kind of orange. Mm, do not get the hook on me. Oh yeah, he wanted the shimmer shad. I knew we would catch one on that lure pretty quickly. Look at the colors on him. He looks a little bit orange on the fins, around the mouth. Very slimy fish. We're going to let him back in now. There he goes. Alright you guys, so first fish of the day was caught on that shimmer shad. 
has so much action that a little aluminum strobe piece what do they call it strobe action so so reflective in the sunlight anyways we got a fish on that fairly quickly we actually got bit within the first five minutes he just didn't get hooked up and now we're gonna go on to the next lure right here the tiny fluke and smoke and shad I like doing the challenge videos because as soon as you catch a fish you switch lures look at that I think that's gonna get a bite extremely well you guys stay tuned that was pretty far I had to stop it I knew it was gonna go far There we go. They were biting at it, and when they came back for it, I set the hook on them. Very nice, very nice. Oh, big one of the day. Here we go. That's more like it. I gotta remember, this is a six pound line. I know we can hold them on there. Yep, there he goes. Nice fish. Oh yeah, he's gonna shake. Do not get that hook in me. Hooked on top of the mouth. Nice one of the day so far. He wanted that little smoke and shad zoom tiny fluke. Pretty nice bass, very healthy. We're gonna let him back in now. Oh yeah, thank you for biting. That is a nice bass. You guys can see we just caught one on that tiny fluke, the smoke and shad. Fairly quickly, very nice profile on this lure. You just nose hook it. I mean, it is made for the drop shot. So much action. Just swimming this lure, bouncing it around. You're gonna get a lot of action out of that fork tail. It's literally a tiny fluke. That smoke and shad color did pretty good. We caught them in about 10 minutes, I think. Up next, I'm gonna rig on one of these, the bomb shot in watermelon red. Very nice lure. Has a lot of oils on it as well. I'll show the little nose hook how I do it right here. There's my little hook. You can actually rig it like this long ways or on the flat part. I'm going to do it on that flat part. That looks pretty good. You guys stay tuned. There we go. Finally. It's been a while without a bite, you guys. About 40 minutes. We got one to bite the bomb shot. Wow, how is he hooked? He's not even hooked. Look at this. The hook is out of his mouth. The line got tangled on him. There we go. We got that out. Nice little fish. Finally, we got one. Put them back in now. All right, you guys. We finally got one to bite that missile baits bomb shot. I think the bite just really died down. That's why I went a while without bites. It's getting pretty hot. I'm going to put on this power bait. I bet it's going to stink. What are they called? Straight monkey? Skeets? Green monkey. You know, power bait. They have a strong scent. Oh, yeah. It stinks. <laughs> it's been a while since I fished a power bait you want to make sure that's closed before you put it in your backpack let's rig it up you guys stay tuned
That's a good bass right there. Wow. It's pretty dark. Good fish. He bit that thing strong. Oh no, he came off. Relax yourself, bass. Relax yourself. Very nice fish. It was down there. Finally, fish number four. Wow. Nice little bass. Let's let him go. There he goes. All right, you guys, we we're finally able to get some bites. It seems like they are biting around this fountain. You just have to keep casting towards it, and somewhere in between the bank and the fountain, they'll bite it. I was getting a couple of short strikes, and I finally got that last fish. Pretty good sized bass on that skeet green monkey, straight monkey, Berkeley power bait worm. He bit it hard. I think it still has a lot of scent. Lots of action on this lure. Great for the drop shot i'm gonna put it back in there how many are in here 15 pack i can stay with that scent up next is our final lure salt release system robo worm and aaron's magic that color is actually very similar to that one it was like a brownish greenish get like a green with blue and then brown on the bottom i'm gonna do the same thing just nose hook it where's my little hook Oh, it's somewhere in the grass. Hopefully we can get fish number five and we would have completed our drop shot only challenge today. You guys stay tuned. All right, you guys, first cast, come on. Robo worm. Now that we know where they're biting, I hope we can get them fairly quickly it's getting pretty hot out here we have 30 minutes left till it's 12 did we get one on the on the fall no way we got one yes you guys on the fall he bit it it was a little one but we'll take it that is amazing <laughs> aaron's magic it is truly some magic hooked on the side of the mouth let me grab him Looks like he's barely hooked. Oh yeah, it just came right out. Pretty nice. Good day of fishing. Wow. We're gonna let him back in. Woo, there he goes. All right, you guys, that's gonna be all for today's video. Overall, a pretty good day of fishing. We were able to get some bites, even though it's very hot. It was faster earlier in the day, but when it started to, when the sun really started to get up there, I'm in the shade right now. The bites really died down and then i was able to figure out the pattern was you gotta fish towards that fountain somewhere in between i guess it's a drop off maybe maybe it's shallow and then deeper and then shallow again i was getting many bites there and uh as you can see here's all the lures that caught us the fish today so if these can work in the heat of the summer believe me year around lures right here there we got the Shimmer Shad by Catchco. That's what caught us the first fish of the day very quickly. Another one that caught us fish quickly early on was the Zoom Tiny Fluke and Smoking Shad. I forgot to show this color. It's actually called Shimmer Shad. This is the natural. It's a four pack, four inches. The Smoking Shad, it just says Tiny Fluke. You get a pack of 20. Very nice. And then, which one was number three? I believe it was the Bomb Shot. Yeah, it is called the Bomb Shot by Water by missile baits this color is watermelon red that lure has a lot of action and a lot of scent it has like little fish oils and crawfish scent as well and then which one was next i believe it was this one that berkeley power bait i had a good feeling we would catch fish on this because of all that scent i'm glad they gave us a 15 pack that is a lot of lures in here skeet's green monkey pro designed by skeet reese the hook to use this is made for the drop shot they have a ton of scent i was able to get the fish on that and then i caught this one a fish on this one with the first cast robo worm four and a half inch straight tail aaron's magic america's number one finesse worm made in the usa must be true i mean we caught them very quickly that's just could have been luck it could have been the the right lure i mean we caught them on the first cast Anyways, that's going to be all for today's video, you guys. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.